Everyone lightweight battle between Nathan Levy versus Pete Rodriguez has been cancelled due to Pete Rodriguez not being able to make the lightweight limit. Nathan Levy reacted and tweeted just to be clear, we were scheduled to fight at 155 pounds. They asked for a catchweight so I agreed to fight him at 158. Then they asked for 160 and I said yes. I was about to go way in when I heard he was crying and losing his shit and quit at 162. If you can cry you still got water in you homie. You still had two hours. Also the UFC will compensate me. I meant I was going to finish him and could have got a bonus that would change my life. On his Instagram he went on to say guys I'm really sorry. Fight is off. Fat Pete couldn't get anywhere near the weight. He blew my opportunity to perform, earn a bonus and make history tomorrow. He probably killed his own career. Extremely unprofessional. Anyone that brought a ticket, I'm really sorry. I will go to the event and would love to meet you. After losing to Aljamain Sterling over the weekend, Henry Cejudo has now set his eyes on his teammate Mirab Devalishvili. He tweeted this is far from over. At Dana White, I want at Mirab Devalishvili's head on a plate. Hashtag UFC Boston. Mirab Devalishvili reacted and tweeted let's go. I will take another off at Funkmaster MMA's leftovers. For now. Over the weekend Matt Frivola defeated Drew Dober via TKO in the first round. After the fight he called out Paddy Pimblett to be his next opponent. Paddy Pimblett recently reacted and on an Instagram post he commented, Bit of a weird time to call me out when I can't even train. But yeah I'd fight Frivola when I'm back. Probably the easiest route into the top 15. 